What's up guys, welcome back. Uh, my video's got a little out of order. This video I recorded a couple weeks ago while in Laconia. I am back at home. Chattahoochee Harley Davidson. I'm John Maxwell, you know the drill. Um, yeah, so this is just a little ride video that I recorded on the way to work while I was in Laconia. Unfortunately, it's the only footage I got while I was there. But uh, enough of that, enjoy. So I'm going to work guys, and I'm going to tell you where I am and what's going on. If you're following me on the social medias, ha, then uh, some of you guys think that I left my job and now I work here in Laconia, but I don't. Where are these kids going? Like, they weren't here the other day. Is school still in up here? School? Oh, like, oh, there's a school, but I, I think school might still be in. All right. Yeah, so I am in Laconia, New Hampshire. No, I'm not. I'm in Meredith, New Hampshire at Laconia Bike Week. And I'm a travel tech. So I'll explain kind of what that is, like how that came to be. So that's Greg. Greg is on a dope O2 nitrate. Uh, he just dynoed it again when he put that D&D fat cat on. I think it's right there at 120. It's, it's powerful. Uh, it's a 103. 103 twin cam, that is. Um, but it was a stock 88. And my bike sounds significantly better, but that's because I have tab performance mufflers. It's Monday for me, which is a common video day, because I have time to edit it to get it out to you by Wednesday. Hopefully that works this week. So I'm staying at Greg's house, so you don't have the internet, so I don't really know how I'm gonna upload this. <laughs> so, Greg and his fiance, Julie, are uh, friends of mine from Orlando days. Uh, we all work together at the Orlando South location when I was in school. As a matter of fact, the general manager of Laconia Harley-Davidson. He was the general manager back then. They're owned by the same people, see? Yeah, so that's my that's my in. And what a travel tech is, is well, get this, are you ready? You travel to be a tech. It's a common rally thing. And honestly, I've never really known anybody that uh, I've never had an in until kind of this year. Greg's the boss, the shop foreman up there. Well, one of the bosses. There's another boss too. And, well, there's a whole slew of bosses. Isn't uh, that how life works? Anyway, so Sturgis does this Laconia, Myrtle Beach, Daytona probably. I don't know if they do. Um, I actually only know Sturgis because I've talked to people that have gone and Myrtle Beach because, well, I've met a guy at one of the Harley classes I took, you know, dealer training classes. And that's kind of how you would meet people. One of the ways you meet folks in dealer training, you used to work there, you work for the same company, but a different dealership. So you can pile all your tools and into a back of your truck and cruise the ways. Uh, it's about 1300 miles for me and it's absolutely gorgeous up here. Easily one of the prettiest places I've ever been. It's so green, so, on this quick little ride in, you're gonna see some some really nice stuff. Probably see some cops too, because they're out in full force this week. Surprise, surprise. Bikes everywhere. I wonder if y'all are even like facing the right way. I think y'all are facing the right way. Like up high enough. I don't even know. Yeah, see like that house right there? Check that guy out. It's on the side of a mountain, a really green mountain. Well, at the time of filming this and in this video, I won't have a, I won't have a meet and greet time if there is one. Um, you'll need to follow me on social media, Facebook, Instagram, to figure that out. Because quite frankly, we've been working like dogs in there. I worked uh, about 12 hours Friday, 12 hours Saturday. 12 hours Sunday. I was there for longer than that, but I was legit working. So I figure with the uh, the in and out times and all that, I'm 
pretty much 40 hours, three days in. And uh, I'm tired. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not running a camera in the shop or anything while I'm here. Um, I'd like to get a tour of the dealership at some point, so hopefully that's a video in the future. <sighs> But I haven't told the bosses that that's what I want to do. So maybe they're, hopefully they're cool with it. I'm going to try to post some stuff up on the social media. Just random stuff I'm seeing. I've been going, you know, so far I've posted a couple things. And that's why, uh, that's why everybody's wondering if I move shops. I didn't. I'll be back, I'll be back in Columbus, Georgia at the end of the, at the end of the week. Yeah, I got a lot of work to do. There's more work than I think I've probably ever done. Ah, my boss is telling me to be mad that I'm actually doing work and I traveled 1,300 miles to do it. <laughs> like I said, we're crushing it in the shop. And, yeah, I just don't have time to film and edit. Edit, edit is, the, is the big one. So, look. Yeah. Not a bad ride into work. Uh, the ride in is, uh, well, the ride home is a lot better. <laughs> you know how it is. Unwind for the day and there's curvy roads and lakes and stuff. Architecture here is awesome. I've never been this far north. I don't think I mentioned that yet. You know, you see like pictures and stuff of Laconia or New England in general. So like, I... So somehow I knew what to expect and not what to expect at all. I didn't realize how green everything would be. Like you can't even see into the woods. Where I'm from, this is it. It's not quite so thick. It doesn't seem like because Pine Tree Nation. Well, I have seen some people, met some folks, you know, out and about. I walk out the service counter. Uh, you know, worked on a couple people's bikes that watch the videos and stuff which is cool it's crazy to be this far from home and putting faces the names from the comment section and stuff it's, it's dope everybody keeps telling me to ride Mount Washington but I don't know if I'll be able to make it with time constraints and on top of that from what I hear ride Mount Washington during bike week is like uh, riding in a you know, a big group ride where it just, uh, what's that term? Like your rubber bands, front to back, like rubber, 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 you like one minute you're close and then you're far away and then you're close again. I don't think people call that rubber band. You guys know what I mean, I hope. I uh, hear some cool buildings. Okay. That was not the section of road that I thought we were at. Also, I have no idea where I am pretty much at all since I've gotten here. Thankfully, Greg's here to show me around. Just probably be lost. Matter of fact, my first test ride got lost. I had a GPS my way back home. I made a wrong turn somewhere from the route that he told me to take. <laughs> Too, which is really cool you know who wants to go to bike week and all you see is one brand even i don't want that
it's up the top of the hill if I know where I am. I wonder if I know where I am yet. Yeah, because there's some crazy. I ain't there. Ha. See, I know where I am, guys. I'm not totally lost. Demo days has been across the street, the motor company here. You ride bikes and stuff all week long. If you like this video, make sure to give it a big dirty thumbs up. If you want to see more content like this, well, usually it's more shop videos. Make sure to hit the subscribe button. It's popping up right now because I can't point at it. And if you hadn't quite got your fix, there's a video also popping up. You know what? There's probably two of them. <laughs> I'll catch you guys in the next one.